Today, the president of China sent a message to the U.S., and he did it in front of world leaders who are gathered at an infrastructure event in Beijing. That, as we reported last night, has been the target of widespread criticism. Yunus Yun is there. President Xi Jinping defended his Belt and Road Initiative and addressed concerns about the massive infrastructure program. Here at the Belt and Road Forum earlier today, President Xi made a keynote speech countering criticism that the program is a debt trap, unfairly favors Chinese companies, and generally needs to be more open. President Xi said China would ensure the financial stability of the projects, have zero tolerance for corruption, and choose projects in a transparent way. But President Xi pushed back on the worries, stoked largely by by Washington with a veiled shot at the U.S. He said, we hope other countries will also create an environment that enables investment, treats Chinese enterprises, students and scholars as equals, and provides a fair and friendly environment. Washington and Beijing have been blocking visas for people, the latest weapon in their rivalry. His remarks show that despite all the talk of inclusiveness here, that China's leadership still isn't fully aware of its contributions to the frustrations of its trading partners like the United States, and that more conflict is likely, whatever happens with a trade deal. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Eunice Yoon in Beijing.